So what's up everyone, X one X, one X, back again here for the video response. This is going to be for Jacob Rocks 100 and Slash is Elite. So I'll leave both of you guys down here, actually as an annotation, annotation and also description. So definitely check out those guys, everyone. Really awesome people to talk to. So um, definitely check out the channel. So let's get started. The question was, what are games you're trying to get into? Um, I have a couple here, I actually somehow managed to get some Super Nintendo games here. Um, some of me bring more than one actually. Um, Super Castlevania 4, I didn't really get into this. Um, a lot of people say it's good and stuff like that. And also there's probably hair if you can see it. You know. Hell bro. Anyways. <laughs> um, Super Castlevania 4, pretty much all the Castlevania games. I'm not really a huge fan of them. I know pretty, pretty much sounds retarded, right? Um, but this one I didn't really get into because, um, I don't know, it's not really fast paced. Like you can't do anything fast pretty much. Um, you have to wait to walk and stuff like that. Kind of reminds me um, a bit of like uh, Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link, which I've kind of gotten into, but still, I'll probably take another look at this. Um, let's see here. Um, okay, that's a good game. Donkey Kong 3, or DKC 3, DKC Kong, Kong, DKC Kong's Double Trouble. Uh, this is the least of my favorite Donkey Kong games ever made. Um, this one just kind of seems stupid as hell. <laughs> I'm not sure why, it just seems funny uh, to think about it and say that. Because um, I actually had this game before. Um, I think I stole it from some kid, but it never worked. So I never got to play until this year, I think, or last year. Um, but this game kind of sucked. Um, you pretty much have to walk around and navigate to where you want to go and stuff like that. It's kind of stupid. It's not like the other Donkey Kong Country games. Um, and also with the baby monkey or gorilla, whatever he is, it's pretty annoying. Um, they needed Diddy Kong or Donkey Kong to do game. Uh, Secret of Emmermore, um, another RPG that I haven't gotten into really playing down. Um, as well as Secret of Mana, but I don't have it anyways. But um, I'll probably get up just because it's kind of hard to find and stuff like that. That's pretty much how I roll. <laughs> so um, Secret of Evermore. I feel like they kind of seem boring, so that's pretty much it. Um, let's see what I'm going to do. Okay, <laughs> I'm just going to destroy all these things. Um, let's put those down there. Um, Super Metroid. I know, I know. Super Metroid. How can I not like this? Um, this game, I kind of I neglected it at first. I didn't start playing it until this year. Yes, this year. Um, I had it since last year, but I finally started playing it because it, it seemed like a good game. Um, but... I'm not a really huge fan of like having to buy a, like a map or something and look up uh, um, tutorials and walkers. I mean, um, kind of seems kind of pointless, but um, I think I beaten that one guy, um, the guy that pretty much turns into to like bones and stuff. I think that was like the fourth boss, maybe. I haven't gotten any farther than that though, so I'll probably give it another try. Uh, Breath of Fire 2. Now this game, I'm just gonna pretty much talk about it. Uh, this game I kind of didn't like it at first as well as um, uh, I forgot the damn game, that name. The Legend of Guy, I think it is? Damn it, I forgot. My game, what the hell. Um, pretty much Guy, whatever. The Guy game, that pretty much didn't appeal to me as much. Um, at, and then later kind of rem reminded me of Dragon Ball Z, like the Legacy of Goku series or franchise, whatever. Um, that's why I started liking that game. The Legend of Gaia, yeah, I think that's what it's called. And, uh, Breath of Fire 2, now this is this pretty much the same concept. Um, I didn't like it, and then I played it afterwards, and it was a pretty good game, but I haven't played it. Um, because you have to pretty much find, like, a statue and whatnot, and, um, save, that's how you save, so it's pretty, um, annoying as hell. Now, this game, I haven't really gone on to playing this either. Um, I know a link to the past. How can I not play this? Um, I've, what, let's see here. 2008, I've gone far at it, or in it, actually, and then I don't know. I had no worries just deleted it, and I just gave up hope. I didn't try again. Uh, the farthest I've gone was um, pretty much like a snake part, and you have to, like, hit it, and there's, like, holes around, like, where you fight. That's, that's the, pretty much, I think, the last boss, or after, I think, if not... I get. I think after um, you use the mirror and stuff like that, so you go to the, the damn. I forgot the name. It's a different kind of world now. 
So pretty much that's a couple of Super Nintendo games. Well, not really a couple. It's been like five minutes and just blabbering. Um, Harvest Moon 64 and Harvest Moon the franchise kind of seemed really boring. Um, yeah, I'm pretty much going off on a rant here. So, let's see here. Um, here's a good one. Yeah, suddenly reached to my right. Or if not for you guys, the left. Um, Twilight Princess. It kind of seemed boring. Star Wars Sword is way better. Um, that's why I pretty much got like a 10. I think it's 10 out of 10. Or 9 out of 10, or 9.5 out of 10. Um, this one kind of seemed really boring, though. Um, not my favorite of the Legend of Zelda series. I think. Is it in this game? No, it's actually in Skyward Sword where you have to fight spiders and stuff like that. And they're like huge spiders, so. Let's see what other games we have here. Um, pretty much I sold all my games that I was to play. And that was my 3DS, so, um, whatever, I'll just end the video here, so, thanks for watching guys, and I'll catch you guys later, take care everyone, so be sure to check out the channels below, and also right here, um, slash elite, and also, um, Jacob Box 100, thanks for watching guys, catch you guys later.